ever since we moved here, um, it's been hard making friends for me. And um, ever since we moved, it's been hard. And also, you know, um, in um, in the Bay as well, you know, it's been hard for us as well. So, um, yeah, yeah, it's getting better for us. You know, the past is over. It's forbidden. You know, we're, we're getting better at it. So it's good, you know. Um, so, yeah, things are getting good. You know, things will get better for you guys if you believe it will. Because I believe it will. And love and belief and faith is all you need in life. And having true friends, I mean, a family that loves you, cares for you so much. You only need that in life and you don't need anything else. You don't need to be popular. You don't need to be different because people will love you just the way you are if you give them a chance to. And I've experienced that. Yeah, so that's what I've learned. And my heart right now is just full of love and open to you guys as well. So yeah, getting it on my chest. So anyway, um, what I'm trying to say is that you'll find the truth as eventually. It may not be in high school. You, 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 it may when you get older. You, it, it may happen when you're, you know, little. You know, who knows? But my friend, my true friends, came to me when they um when when they told the truth to me and how they like me for who I am and even though I'm different they they love me you know you know that's when it's important and people who are your friends you know some people called my mom like this was earlier in the year when I had trouble with bullies um you know mom had to keep me home for a couple of days until I was readjusted like moved I guess but um, yeah, those girls that are on the phone to my mom, they just wanted to get in the drama, you know. They didn't even care about my feelings. They didn't even care at all. And I was being so tough on them because they didn't care of how I feel. And that's the problem in the world because people don't care. They just want to get in the drama, you know. You know, girls make a lot of drama these days. I've been there, you know. And it's a sad part, okay. Not the sad part, but... I have a friend, you know, you probably know her name because I said it earlier. I have a friend and she used to go into, um, you know, if she would um, leave me and, you know, and come back, she would always come back. But sometimes she would just, um, let me think, ditch me at times, you know. Um, I, I know it's hard to believe, but I'm still friends with her. Everything's good, everything's okay, but this was like a while back, so... She used to ditch me a lot, and um, you know, she. I, I always, I would, I always rely on her, and I would tell her about what's wrong and stuff. You know, she's always been there for me. You know, she's, you know, she's, she's the first. She's the. She's my friend since year five and stuff. I know she's always been there for me. You know, I'm still friends with her though. But um. Uh, let me think. You know, she's, you know, you don't, you can't rely on one person. You have to rely on other people as well who are your friends, who are your true friends, and not just friends, friends, just true friends. You have to rely on your true friends because you need to open up to them at some point. It's so always to be your friend. You choose. You choose if you want to be their friend or not because I am very cautious of my friends. And, you know, these girls have standing up to me when. You know, things would get wrong and, um, you know, I would stand up for them as well. You know, they're, they're, they're your true friends. And I know I said this before, but they are really are your true friends. If they stand up for you, really care about you and text you and, you know, say you're my best friend. And, um, but people, if they say, oh, do you want to be your friend? Then you've tried with them. They just don't want to be your friend. They don't want to get to know you. They don't want to get to know your family at all. They're just, uh, you know. Not bitches, but they just thought it would be your friend. And that's okay, because some people in life don't know how to choose their real friends. But I most certainly have it. I'm, I'm, I am very blessed in life that God gave me this life. And I know I'm not vain, vague when I say that, but it's true. I'm, I'm glad that God ga gave me to a family that loves me. And true friends who've always supported me. I'm thankful for that. So thank you, God, for making my life special. Even though things are rough at times. So, yeah. so 
my idiots, you're right. Right, my some girls will make up drama. Now I know you guys have experienced this, this, but um, you know, people would say, you know, actually, um, there was this one time at school, um, who she's not my friend anymore, but um, you know, she said someone actually made up a lie that she slept with someone, and that is totally gross. And you know, girls are just, I'm sorry, but they're bitches. I know, I know that sounds harsh, but. Especially mean girls and, you know, stuff like that. But, you know, if they make stuff like that, they are going to be very, very bad people who are going to hurt people, okay? So they don't, they just want to take advantage of what you have and what you have. And they want to have your life. Um, people come over here sometimes and they say, oh my god, Mila, your room is so beautiful. And now it's changed because, as you can see, I've got like, um... Like a bunker, not like a bunker, but a high bunker. Like everything's changed. I'll give you um, a vlog about it, okay? So, um, oh, what was I gonna say? Ah, oh, yes. So, even though there are a lot of stuff happening in your life right now, they are going to get better. Trust me. Just trust me on this. It will. Because, and life is getting better for me right now. I'm just not letting myself think about it. I'm just worried about the bad stuff. Because I have to go back to school. Oh, and, um, so this girl is, like, in, um, in a different part of the world now. I'm not going to say England, because she's not in England, you know. Uh, she does have to go, so she's getting, like, these audio meme feeds from her, and she doesn't have to go to school with her. She's not lucky, I guess, what I try to say, but I have to go back to school with this girl, and if she's going to turn nasty on me again, you know, she would, you know, we don't know what to do. So, but don't worry, my mom's going to handle it, so, you know. Um, you know, drama happens, you know. Drama um, is not true, you know. Um, drama is just another way of, say, getting attention from someone. And drama is a bad feed and I said about I'm try I'm trying to get out of drama. You know. Uh, it's true, you know, drama is kind of like a big not a big threat, but just general drama. Like if you have a crush on a boy and everybody goes and like oh, so who is it? And like, oh, you're in love and then the next thing you know they turn nasty on you. That's how it ha how it happened to me because this girl I she used to be like friend they made me laugh when I was sad. But um unfortunately she's turned nasty over me for no reason because she, you know, she just would have taken advantage of me. So that's her fault, okay? So remember those fears because life will get better for you guys if you believe it. And I believe it will. And right now, I just can think of what else to say and, you know, it's... <sighs> I just feel so relieved talking about this to you guys. And, you know, you understand, you know, you know, so I think that's all, all I've got to say, so, um, I think that's all I've got to say, you guys, um, like, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time, bye!